we've just been doing photos again for the Carers Trust um, with uh, Mark Summers, who is the best Elvis impersonator we've ever had here. We've sold out, he's absolutely fantastic, really, really nice guy, comes all the way down from Birmingham, uh, has, is happy to have photographs with the customers, he's brilliant. Obviously, it's always a toss-up whether the customers want a photo with Mark or myself, uh, but uh, Mark's won on this occasion. One, two, one, two, three. Two, one, two, hey, there we go, we've got the thing very much. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, uh, welcome to Grove the Casino for our fantastic Elvis Presley tribute act this evening, Mark Summers, who is absolutely fantastic. I hope you're going to have a brilliant time. When I first got into doing this, I was looking at all the old guys in the big fat jumpsuits. It wasn't Elvis. You know, Elvis was full of energy, full of charisma. Um, he looked amazing. He was, he was a magnet to the girls. And then you got these guys walking out, you know, like 20 stone, and it just it's wrong. Um, so yeah, I, uh, I kind of really respect what I do. Because I trained as an actor, um, and as an actor you kind of, you have to become the character. So, you know, if you're Daniel Craig and they say, be James Bond, then if somebody says, are you James Bond? Well, yeah, because that's what you, you, you know, you're getting paid to do. So really, when people say, do you think you're Elvis? On stage, yeah, because if I didn't believe it, then how are you guys supposed to believe it? You know, so you have to kind of be Elvis um, with charisma, movements, looks, um, and obviously the voice, you know, it's, it's quite a unique voice. Sure, well, uh, yeah, it's my first time here uh, tonight, and uh, you know, the, the people down here are so cool and, uh, and friendly, and we, we just have a ball, you know? Uh, we was lucky enough to meet Priscilla Presley um, back in January um, and she actually invited us backstage to her dressing room um, and she never does pictures with Elvis tributes and we was told not to ask for them. Um, we went backstage and she just said, this is fine, let's take pictures. She goes, I, lo I love it, I love the look. Um, I had a young Priscilla lookalike with me, tribute, and she was just gobsmacked. She was like, I love the concept, how fresh, and it was a unique kind of idea for a show. She loved it. Um, the weird thing was, she was just so funny, down to earth, um, not really what I expected. She just made us feel so at ease, and if we, as you know, as, like, as if we'd known her for years, and really friendly, funny. Oh, she was brilliant. You do like to dress up, don't you? <laughs> um, uh, yeah, I do, I suppose. Uh, I, I, don't, I really don't know where that comes from. <laughs> I said to James, I said, look, I want, I want to get dressed up, I want to dress up as Elvis and sell some Elvis sunglasses and things for uh, charity, the Carers Trust that we support, um, which uh, James kind of, I don't know if he thought I was joking or whatever, but they, they said, fine, go ahead. Um, they supported me in that, they, they enabled me to buy the Elvis wig and hire the Elvis suit. And, and when I put it on, I was like, well, this is it, this is fantastic. So, you know, I, I went down into the casino and I was walking around. I, could, I, I went to, we go to networking groups and I was turning up at networking groups dressed as Elvis, promoting events, etc. And it was, uh, yeah, I, I did enjoy it. And then pretty much any event that I've put on, I've kind of, 
I try and really get involved in that event and I show, hopefully I show that to all the other staff members, to the customers, that I'm putting some effort into it. You need several people within a team that have strengths and weaknesses in different areas. Certainly a weakness for me is getting dressed up as Elvis or as Tina Turner, whoever else you might want to get dressed up as. There's nowhere in Norfolk where you can go and get the experience that we provide. Everything that you would want for a night out is all under one roof here. You can go up and down the country out of the 57 clubs. This one is not like any other and that's, that's why I'm so passionate about it. I absolutely love it. It's like a